Guys, it is finally here. Jigsaw Circuit in the flesh. Shout out to my boy Cal for this amazing custom track that he made exclusively for Mario Kart Wii. Here we are today in verse mode going up against some awesome CPU. We're going to be racing around the track as well as showcase some of the assets. And the first thing I want to showcase is this awesome starting line. We have the Jigsaw Flex logo as well as my mascot, Red Mr. L. And what better way to celebrate Mr. L with that awesome Super Paper Mario music to play in the background. So, this is Jigsaw Circuit as mentioned. It's supposed to be a circuit-based track. Um, a lot of inspiration from Luigi Circuit, but I love how he made it different, you know, by adding, you know, obviously channel assets and other things that make it stand out, like this tunnel, for example. And uh, the fact that the road has two different uh, ways, technically. And this alternate route that you can take if you really want to. I don't know if this is actually faster, to be honest, but uh, I do love this view. This view is freaking awesome. You see the stadium in the background, um, the Mr. L hat, as well as this auto shop or garage. I still don't know what that is that they included from the base game. So uh, yeah, here we are in the second lap. The lighting fixtures are great. I love the colors. They pop. They're very saturated, very colorful. Just, you know, fits the vibe that I'm looking for. So shout out to Cal yet again for this amazing mod. We're going to take this awesome ramp here. You can trick off of that if you really want to. Also, if you guys did not know, this is Cal's first ever custom track. So that's why this project took a couple months. You know, he was learning the game. Um, here is the other route that you can take here. There's a shortcut you can take, but uh, make sure you take a mushroom instead of just going straight through because otherwise it's just off-road okay baby daisy just got hit over there and of course if you guys did already notice the item boxes are a little bit different and also the red mr l uh statues right here see right here is the jigsaw flex logo on the actual item boxes too it's insane and um the pipes are a different color too it's not just like green it's like aquamarine or turquoise whatever you want to call it so yeah one final time, we got the nice logos here too. Here we go. Let's see, we didn't get hit. Let's go off the ramp for the win. Jigsaw Circuit getting first place. It's Jigsaw Flex. Here we go. Getting hit by the blue. Bruh, what a freaking finish. Guys, that was amazing. Like I said, if you want to check out the mod, be sure to click the description down below to download it. But here we are now going to test it out in time trials. All right, so we are back here in time trials because I want to show you guys all the things that Cal included. So the first thing I noticed was this awesome blimp in the background. Look at that. You can't really see it, but the emblem is switched, like, like mirrored horizontally. And that's supposed to be like that because Mr. L has like a backwards L. So I really like the touch that he made over there. And it's just, you know, in the background. And another thing I really noticed too in the beginning are just the hills that he put. Like, it just looks like it's from Paper Mario in general. I just like get that Petal Meadows vibe or something from Thousand Year Door. And um, other things that he included are these advertisements. You know, we got the Midnight logo, you know, Mario Kart Midnight, because I stream a lot of Mario Kart Midnight in the channel. So uh, yeah, we got Mario Kart Midnight there. It's a phenomenal mod. You guys should definitely check it out. Of course, we got my logo yet again, but next to it, we got the Jigsaw Circuit emblem. We got Jigsaw, then Circuit in the middle is Mr. L just jumping. Of course, it's red. We got Flex Tires because what better way to advertise my tire company by putting, obviously, my company logo. Duh. Of course, we got signs to indicate where to go. Of course, mushrooms to indicate we're in the Mushroom Kingdom. A red mushroom looks very colorful. I love how it pops. And you can tell there's elevation changes in this track. So we start off like literally from the top section and then we go like down, like just very slightly. You can't really tell like when you're playing this track, but it does happen. So I really like what he did to make it more elevated, to make the track more like it's like revolutionary. Um, of course, we got the boost panel here. We got a parking lot, which is awesome. I'm going to showcase it in the next lap a little bit more. Um, so here is the jigsaw flex or red luigi statue you can't really see it from this angle but you definitely saw it from the cutscene um it stands right here and there's these pipes are angled now originally his plan was to make the pipes shoot out like random items like from item rain but he couldn't figure it out which was uh kind of disappointing but at the same time i can understand because coding and uh very difficult to make that happen so if someone knows how to do that for whatever reason if you're awesome at like coding in mario kart 
uh, feel free to suggest down below. Maybe we can get that working. Um, we also got these uh, walls, but they're actually bricks and stuff from the Mario series. So I like how he added that. I don't think that's from the base game. So that's cool. He added that. Um, we have more advertisements and then where we're racing around actually is where like the people are like the stadium of people they're chilling cheering and whatnot um here's that ramp that we took earlier and uh more pipes like i said they're like a turquoise color um i like how they're not just you know regular green doesn't blend in with the grass and honestly this track i feel like would be pretty good in hide and seek you know the mod in mario kart wii where you can like hide and then there's a seeker and then you just like chill hiding behind this bush i really like how it's 2d not gonna lie because again paper mario has a lot of 2d stuff so it's cool that you could just like hide from um people in the bush and stuff and yeah there's more stuff like look how big this area is this is just all off-road you know that you can explore and i like how it's not just all grass there's actually like ponds and stuff like that so that's really cool. Um, here's that tunnel from earlier, which is uh, awesome to include because it makes it, again, less boring. And we actually go up here. So elevation changes yet again. And when I mentioned earlier about the road, yeah, like the road is not just one like pavement color. Like I like how there's these like streaks here. Um, there's the yellow lines to indicate like one way and the other way, even though obviously you don't drive the other way. Um, more background scenery, which I really adore. The emblem that I was talking about earlier, Jigsaw Circuit. I'm sure they have that in the regular Luigi Circuit, but of course this has the Mr. L thinking you know, logo, just saying Jigsaw Circuit as well. Really clean, I like that, you know. Even if you get up close to it, it doesn't really look blurry or something. I really like how he did a phenomenal job making everything pretty much clean. I like how this is also kind of inclined, so you can like get on top to the shortcut. I'm just calling it the shortcut to be honest, because I, I think it's faster, I don't know. I can't get over the, um, the scenery here too. Like you can literally just see like, an overhead of the actual, you know, map itself. So I like how there is, again, a big pond down the middle. And um, you can see, like, every corner of the track. Again, the parking garage, parking lot, the stadium, the blimp, and everything. And, of course, more advertisements. Guys, be sure to check out Flex Tires. It is an amazing company to get your tires from. And, uh, yeah, so that is the first lap. Again, more, um, more bricks so you don't, like, cheese the level. Like, this is here, so you don't, like, I don't know, cut and do, like, an ultra shortcut or whatnot. But, uh, yeah, we're back in the beginning. So, the next thing I want to showcase is the parking garage slash uh, parking lot. So, Cal told me you can actually get inside. So, to do that, you just gotta go here, angle yourself correctly, and hop here. Boing! So this is literally accessible. Again, more fun for uh, hide and seek. <laughs> um, there's nothing here. He did want to include some memes, but due to you know hardware limitations or wanting the track basically to flow and not lag, you know he decided to scrap them, which is fine. So it does not matter. Everything looks clean, which is what something I I do adore. It looks pr very professional. Um, we got the cars as well. This is from like I guess Coconut Mall. He took from it says Pow. I love how there's a red one here two yellow ones and two blues i don't know if he made like one red to signify that's my car but let's just say that's my car because it's a red car and the only red car we have again the logo jigsaw circuit the emblem just chilling there it's really nice you can see it like up front um and yeah jigsaw flex logo again here too oh my gosh you can't really see it from this angle all right there you go now you can see the logo it's just says jigsaw flex with like the nintendo border so I like how we replaced Nintendo with Jigsaw Flex with a copyright symbol. By the way, if you guys are wondering how I got out of the parking garage section, he put a ramp here so you can like easily get out. So I didn't just like teleport. <laughs> that would have been funny though. Um, here's this part. I really like how this looks scenery wise. There's like two shortcuts you can pretty much take, right? You can take this ramp. And then if you have another shroom or like a star, you can take a double cut. And finally, we have another shortcut that you can take over here if you want. It might take two shrooms if you take it like fully, but um, yeah, it still works. I like how you put obstacles there so it's not like really easy. But yeah, other than that, that is pretty much Jigsaw Circuit, guys. We're going to race on it one more time for the final lap. Guys, be sure to check the description down below. Support Cal. He's probably going to make more custom tracks in the future. And, um, you know, 
Be sure to let me know what you guys think of the custom track. Again, this is based off of my YouTube channel. And uh, if anyone knows how to make the item rain, you know, concept happen over there, feel free to put it in the comment section below. Oh my god, I also just realized the minimap does look like, does look like the freaking, uh, what do you call it? My hand, pretty much. <laughs> That's so funny. It's just like this, and it kind of looks like that. I don't think Cal intended to make the minimap look like that, but, uh... Yeah, it does fit. <laughs> but yeah, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Shout out to Cal yet again for the amazing track. And leave a like if you did enjoy. And that was Jigsaw Circuit. Thank you guys again, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.